This is some rattlesnake pole beans. Uh, we'll allow them to grow all the way up this frame right here. They'll get all the way to the top and they'll lay over on that upper frame there and cover it up completely. These have been in the ground now about maybe two weeks. And uh, what I need to do now is come in here and do some thinning. They're getting ready to start running. And you can see right here, we have two plants that's about an inch apart. So what we're gonna do is we'll pull one of them out. We'll just take that one over there out and pull it out. And it winds up going in the compost. So we'll go down through here and do the same way, just thin them out where they're standing about six inches apart. You notice, you can see that there's three rows down through here. And we'll begin to lay over and uh, start to bloom. Seventeenth of October, and it's time to harvest the rattlesnake pole beans, dry beans that we will be using for next year's seed. If you look down through there, you see a lot of dry beans hanging down through there.